All right, guys. So uh, I promised to show you my Firebelly Newt setup. Um, it's still a work in progress. I've been working on this tank for quite a while now. I uh, got it off a buddy of mine and uh, he gave it to me for free. I had to redo all the silicone on it. I redid the whole stand. I did a bunch of patchwork, new hardware, um, painted the whole thing. Had a little bit of rot going around the bottom. Fixed all that up and. Uh, Got it all nice and cleaned up, and uh, it's going good so far. I am running two heaters in there right now. I don't have the proper heater or the proper filtration. The filtration's not as efficient for how many gallons I have here, but it does like half it for right now. But eventually, I'll uh, update that stuff very soon. Uh, like I said, it's still a work in progress, and I'm um, getting it done as quick as I can. But I thought I'd show this to you guys. I did grab a couple of fish. I got a red-tailed shark in there. And a couple neon tetras. Uh, doing pretty good. Uh, no deaths yet. The I actually put the neon tetras in there first to, to make sure everything was good. I tested the water and everything. so Which they're doing perfect. Uh, I didn't expect any less. So that's good. Uh, the fire belly newts. I put them in here already too, and they seem to be doing great. I catch them climbing around back and forth between the two land spots. I know it's kind of hard to see. I just had the lid off, and then um, I put the lid back on, and it, I'll have to run some fans in here and stuff to kind of get rid of the condensation. But uh, yeah, I want I want to do a little uh, aquatic planted out section for them, and uh, I do have a couple of small little different types of ferns and uh, baby tears and uh, I don't really know all the aquatic names so a bunch of java moss um, I don't know a lot of aquatic plants so but uh, I got a little nepenthes up here in the corner maybe you can see it here uh, normally they seem to be hiding up in here a lot and I don't see any unfortunately actually do I no I don't um, but yeah it's doing pretty good uh, it's running on a sponge filter right now but hopefully by the end of next week I'll have a brand new filter for this uh, we'll see how that goes um, I don't know if you can see them over here they hide up here a lot Um, and sometimes they venture off down into the water too, catch them right along the edges of the water. But as you see, everything's doing good. I have no issues with anything right now, uh, besides a little bit of mold on that one new log. But I got springtails in there, they'll clean it up. Eventually that will go away, but for right now, everything looks great. I wish I could show you the fire belly newts. Uh, I do have to get the lid a little more sorted out. I got a couple like spots I gotta make for uh, any wires or tubing or anything. And then uh, I gotta set up some fans in here somehow. So I do got quite a bit of work to be doing on this, but it looks great. And uh, I just wanted to show you guys this. I'm super excited to finally have them in something proper. A proper setup for them uh, I will be getting some more fish different types of little schools I don't want to go too crazy on the fish I don't want too much in there um, maybe a couple little shrimp but even on the shrimp I'll have to get on the bigger end just so the newts don't eat them but I don't know we'll see we'll see how this goes uh, hoping for the best uh, yeah I don't really know what this else to say um, any other questions I can answer, you can leave them down in the comments. Um, thank you. Have a good day.